A big corporate buyout could change the way you shop for groceries in Hampton Roads. Early this morning, Kroger announced plans to buy Harris Teeter for nearly two and a half billion dollars. Tony, your side, Stephanie Harris, spent the day digging into what this could mean for your wallet and produce. Stephanie? Nicole Tom, a lot of shoppers out there upset about this merger, specifically the Harris Teeter shoppers. You can just check out our wavy Facebook page or the Harris Teeter page and read hundreds of complaints. They're worried about everything from coupons to quality. So I spent the day working to get them answers. People who shop at Kroger always Kroger have their reasons. I don't shop Harris Teeter unless something's on sale because they're way overpriced. Harris Teeter loyalists have their own differing views. This is a whole upper sales store than Kroger is. So a merger is making shoppers and employees a bit nervous. I don't know how that's going to go. The main concerns we found are these. Coupons. Kroger recently stopped doubling coupons while Harris Teeter still does. Kroger customers don't want to see their prices go up while Harris Teeter customers say they don't want the quality of service, store appearance and fresh foods to go down. Will any stores close? Hampton Roads is home to seven Kroger stores and 12 Harris Teeters. And what about those being built in Hampton Roads, including the Harris Teeter in Ward's Corner and the Kroger Marketplace in Portsmouth? Kroger says it has no plans to close any stores. Harris Teeter will continue to be led by its senior management team and keep its headquarters in North Carolina. Both chains say they do not anticipate any job loss. And in what appeared to be a direct response to concerned customers, Harris Teeter wrote on its website this afternoon, Rest assured, you should find your favorite meat cutter, cake decorator, or cashier at your Harris Teeter. Fast checkout lanes, friendly associates, and the same high-quality Angus beef and boar's head brand. As for those coupons, when I called Harris Teeter, they would not answer any of my questions. But Kroger spokesperson said late this afternoon, it is too soon to say what operational decisions will be made in the future. And as of now, it appears all stores being built in Hampton Roads, both the Harris Teeters and the Kroger's, are still a go. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side. Harris Teeter shareholders still have to vote on the merger, and it still needs approval from the FTC. So nothing will be final for several months.